Yo, so guys, and welcome back to a brand new HMSP news video. Today, we're going to be talking about why MotoGP 2021 rider market could be very, very exciting. And the reason for that is that every single rider, except one, which is Tito Rabat, um, every other rider's contract ends at the end of this 2020 season. And that obviously means we could see a major shakeup in the grid with plenty of rider transfers, riders retiring, you know, anything, anything, anything could happen at the end of 2020, which is going to be very, very exciting, obviously, with the likes of, you know, Mark Marcus, will we see him finally change manufacturer, uh, Vinales, you know, there's a load of talks of him with Suzuki, load of talks of him with Ducati, Valentina Rossi, will he switch roles with Fabio Cartararo? Who knows? Uh, Danny, Danilo Petrucci, will he get replaced by Jack Miller? There is plenty of things that could happen at the end of this season. And it's going to be a very exciting season to watch, to see all of these top riders, especially the factory riders, performing at their best to make sure they can get a contract renewal with the factory team to not fall down the order or fall out of MotoGP. Uh, itself so it's gonna be a very exciting season to watch to see everyone you know going to you know pushing as hard as possible to get them wins and get those contracts and uh, it's gonna be very interesting to see if we do get any major transfers which hopefully we do you know hopefully it's not gonna be one of these rider markets where nothing really happens and everyone just kind of stays with the same team you know hopefully we do get a major switch up and um, you know, when we come to uh, Money GP 2021, we've got a totally different looking grid with plenty of rider transfers. So, um, you know, that would be quite exciting. Hopefully that is what's going to happen. Um, but we just never, never know. But um, yeah, I thought it was interesting, you know, when I saw that everyone's contract ends next season, apart from Tito Rabat, who signed uh, a longer contract with that Avintia team. Um, but um, yeah, and then obviously we have Andrea Iannone, who's provisionally suspended um, with that doping test malarkey. So we don't know if he would be able to come back in the future or not. We, we don't know about him. But um, yeah, guys, make sure you leave it down in the comment section. Do you think we'll see any major transfers at the end of this season? Or do you think everyone will kind of just stay put and not really move around. Hopefully we do get a different grid. Uh, a little bit like um, 2016 or 17, I think it was. Uh, you know, when we had a, a nice little variety of changes. You know, hopefully something like that happens uh, for this uh, next season. But um, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like and subscribe for more content as always. Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and the bell to make sure you get notified for all future videos. Hopefully you had a wonderful day and I'll see you with some brand new videos very soon.